when we're not trying to stay undercover in the desert. Yeah, we're like under the radar. We like to answer questions and comments we get on YouTube, so let's get to it. All right, so the real burning question here is why is the madman Davidas taking me through the desert? You're gonna have to wait till the end to find out when we answer that question. But right now we are driving from Los Angeles to Las Vegas, answering some some of the most fire questions from the people. So should we should we get started? Should we do a few Davi? Yeah. <laughs> Number one burning question for the desert boys: Who's your favorite Harry Potter character? Do I go first? Or do you, you go, go first? first. As a as, as a gentleman, I see. That's a was a Ramil Devane. She was kind of cute, but they only showed her for like one minute. Um. So, uh, really, the least important character that's kind of hot <laughs> yeah. is your favorite character. That's it. Makes sense. Makes a lot of sense. And that. I like, you know, I liked Lupin. I thought the movies did yeah. Lupin. The movies did Lupin kind of dirty. They made him a little too shabby in the movies. Yeah, Lupin's a badass. I always felt, yeah, right? See what I'm saying? Yeah, Lupin. See, you're on Team Lupin. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, okay, so that's that. What's the coolest thing you saw at NAMM? Mmm. Mmm. Mm. A lot of cool things. A lot of cool things. <laughs> what? Sean. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, yeah, oh, oh, you'd like me to start? <laughs> no, I saw this thing. It tilts the amp. So you can wait for it. You can hear the amp better. It's called Amp Wedging. <laughs> Billion dollar idea. You just use some junk you put under your it's amp. It's a rubber. It's a rubber thing. Oh, it's rubber. Oh, oh, it's not junk. Tilt it up. I'm just waiting for that amp wedgie sponsor money. No, so on I'm the serious note, Ernie Ball Kaizen. It's a seven string, right? Seven string, fan fret, tremolo. New generation tuners, like they kind of like just tune differently. The only thing I would have done, the tremolo should be recessed so you can pull up. You can't pull up on that. Okay. I don't know. They need to give you a signature guitar. I feel like you're you're more deserving. I'll. I'll well, I'll, well, let's. Well, that's a different video. That's a different video. I like the Martin Modern Deluxes. Those like looked really cool. Again, they're very traditional. I wouldn't say it's like new and cutting edge, like an amp wedgie. Right. Uh, the coolest the coolest thing I saw in Am was probably probably Samurai Guitarist. It's my boy. He wants Am as he always does. Well, that's. <laughs> you don't like that answer? Was that no, cheating? I do, I do like that. that I didn't cheating? know we do people. See, now you feel bad. Now you feel like you betrayed the people that you saw. Yeah, because then I would have said like that. Oh, God. I don't know what you would have said. <laughs> Whatever it is that you would have said, I would have had to edit it out. Yeah, exactly. That's all I know. When is the collab album coming? So the collab album is the Lithuanian Riders. It's kind of like uh, taking... Not, not the Emerald Riders. Yeah, it's essentially like a, like a sequel. Uh, it's a three-part, uh, three-CD. Uh, There's also going to be a limited edition uh, vinyl, uh, and it's going to be yellow, green, and red. The green has a callback, part two, Lithuanian Riders to the Emerald Riders, and the yellow and red in, uh, you know, like uh, yellow light, red light. Oh. And is also a flag of Lithuania, yellow, green, red, but in a different order. But, yeah, exactly. And, um, so we're gonna have like a. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna have all the original All Stars reunion. You know, like all of them. The, wait, the original writers? Yeah, everyone who has even touched the project, we're gonna have like a class reunion for this this project. Eighty percent of those people I don't talk to anymore, and I had a. <laughs> and I had a <laughs> Violent falling outs with, but <laughs> <laughs> but Davidas is arranged and awkward. Yeah, an awkward reunion. So uh, the energy in the studio will be electric. That's right. You know that's how great music is made. It's yeah. like Fleetwood Mac rumor rumors. So it is scheduled for November of twenty thirty five. That's about that's about right. That's about that's about when I'll be ready to. <laughs> finish my therapy and, and, <laughs> <laughs> and pick so, that project up again. Lithuanian writers in stores near you. In the meantime, maybe someone could listen to the other albums. Link in the description. <laughs> Five, four, or seven, eight? No. <laughs> oh, just no. No. Um, 
<laughs> all right, you're right, guy. I'll, you, I'll go first while you try to compose yourself. Oh, okay. I, look, look at these. I feel like I'm like a, this is like a police surveillance <laughs> like operation <laughs> with all these things. <laughs> Driving the the gold wrapped Mercedes through the desert. I love it. Five four. Five four has like utility. Like I feel like some things just naturally are in five four. Nothing's naturally in seven eight, right? Like you have to go out of your way to make something in seven eight. I I think. Okay. All right. Uh, so five four. I I say neither. I say thirty four thirty five. You know why? Why was that? Sixty nine, dudes. <laughs> <laughs> who's Big Spoon and who's Little Spoon? You know, I don't subscribe to the limitations of cutlery that you try to put us in. Mm -mm. It's not about the spoonage. What is it? Tell them. Tell them what we are. We are both Swiss Army knives. What do you What do you need? What do the people need? I'm a Swiss Army knife for the people. Because the, the people are our little spoons. Right? Is that why is that so funny to you? <laughs> I just see a bunch of little spoons. <laughs> <laughs> but like you know, like the plastic ones. You know? Oh, that's you you insult the people. I don't know. That's the You're only that... context you see a lot of spoons in. Have you ever seen a lot of metal spoons? Yeah, like fancy uh, funerals and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Look, whatever you are, big spoon, little spoon, little spoon, doesn't matter if you're like a knife, a fork, doesn't matter. As right. long as you're not a straw, meaning like plastic on the outside and hollow in the middle. Oh, wow. That was really nice, actually. That was beautiful. Right? Like, And here's, here's another thing. If you're a big spoon, try being a little spoon sometimes. Versatility. Life is about variety. Variety is the spice of life. Oh, what if they're a spork? Right? I mean, that's uh, that's the ultimate goal for any of us to have. 69, dudes! <laughs> Who gets recognized more? It's it's all in the context. Okay, so, like, for me, it's uh, Chocolate Anonymous uh, <laughs> support group. Also, uh, uh, ski goggles for casualdriving.com meetings. <laughs> I, you know, I think it's, I I feel like it's not even ski. It's more like a like a Hulk Hogan, like Macho Man Randy Savage, like early '90s wrestler vibe, <laughs> which you get casual driving. Me, I get more recognized as like the one guy that shops at Lululemon, or uh, the if if the the most expensive cold brew in any town that you can find, that's where I'm gonna get recognized more often. In real life, it's, it's dive diving is man, you get uh, recognized all the time now. It's awesome. It's, it's tough being around him. It's tough getting this man's attention. That's why I'm cherishing these these precious moments I have, his undivided attention on the road through the desert. <laughs> oh man. The reason why Davi brought me to the desert is becoming more clear with every passing second. It's just the overpass blocking it right now. This is not the best. Isn't it funny when, like, you have a camera and you're like, maybe if I get lower, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, so now for the real reason that this man dragged me out in the desert. Yeah. Is because uh, we're sitting right up front of the Katy Perry concert. <laughs> <laughs> Only the finest. Yeah. My boy, my boy, right? Yeah, what is she, like, wearing green and she's like, I ride. And she did give you, like, Rides? the Jeep wave. <laughs> bro, then, bro, then I'm going to have to bounce. And you're gonna have to go home solo tonight. <laughs> we'll see what happens.
Bro, did we just become the biggest Katy Perry fans in the world? We were like a plastic bag in the, in the wind. And did you ever feel? Bro. Like. <laughs> insane. Insane.